So I'm prepping this Caesar salad, pasta salad that I'm doing for lunch this week. Quick and easy prep. I am using this Fiber Gourmet, which is less calories and it has a ton of fiber, which is good if you are getting a lot of protein. So yeah, macros for this. Take the good old screenshot. Uh, okay, well, you don't need to see the barcode. I'm thinking I'm, thinking I'm scanning my, uh, my uh, fitness app. Okay, so yeah, go ahead and boil this pasta. I usually do it about 15 minutes. Um, I don't think the box says that, but yeah, that's how we're starting. So I have them divided up into five different containers. Even though the pasta has four servings, I split it up into five different containers. Also, um, either the last one or two, I'm probably just going to end up freezing. So, um, cause I, I kind of don't like my food to go bad. So yeah, pasta is separated. So for the chicken, I'm using these mesquite grilled chicken fillets. Now I'm going to cook two of these and I'm going to divide them in half um, and each one is going to go in here. Now you could also use like rotisserie chicken or whatever but this is what I have so this is what I will be using. They're smoked and there these are some pretty decent sized uh, chicken so this is what I'm going to use. I'm going to stick them in the air fryer for a second. My ancient air fryer over there. Yeah. Okay so this is it separated with the chicken like I said for the fifth one I'm not adding chicken yet. Um, so this is that. I am now going to add a tablespoon of these uh, bacon bits to each container. Like I said, the last one I'll do another time. That's probably going to go in the freezer. Um, so yeah, tablespoon of these bacon bits. Okay, so I'm going to use this dressing. This is the light uh, creamy Caesar. Um, and this is a, a lot less calories than the original. And then I have these cups that I'm going to use. It's, if you can, get cups that you can reuse. I have some uh, lunch cups like this that I that are reusable. They're like a, a brass, silver type of thing. Let me see if I can find them for y'all. So I have these. These are like a, like a brass type of thing. Um, and then these are the lids. And the lids pop on very good. And they don't leak at all. But I have like maybe, maybe 10 or 12 or so came in the pack. But I have these and I need to use these, okay? But if you can get reusable ones, get reusable ones. And if you don't, you know, no biggie. But I do have these, so I'm going to use these. So I'm going to uh, separate the um, Caesar salad dressing into these cups for each of the bins. Okay, so there's this I have. This is supposed to be chopped, chopped. <laughs> Well, babe, this isn't chopped, okay? Um, so I don't know what Walmart be on, but um, yeah. So I I only have lunch one day out of the week outside of the home. So I will show you guys how I pack this up. But for the most part, this is done. Um, when I pack my lunch, I will pack some croutons and then I will pack some lettuce too. But for the most part, this is over. I did not put uh, a cup in here because I'm about to eat this one. Um, and you know, waste not what not. We're a waste, non-waste household. We try to not waste as much as possible. Uh, but I'm getting ready to wash this and put it through my salad spinner and then chop it, <laughs> actually chop it. Um, and then I'll show you guys how this is put together. But I am going to still show you how I put my lunch together when I have to pack my lunch. My son has a co-op. And I'm not sure if you know what a co-op is, but if you have homeschool kids and you know what a co-op is in co-op, we, we bring a lunch and, um, you know, we just kind of hang out for a few hours every week. So one of these I will be packing with us to go, but, um, yeah, I'm getting ready to wash this and then chop up some of it. I don't chop up all of it at, at right away. And since I work from home, I don't have to, um, I don't have to pack everything in the container, but what matters, this is what matters. Okay. And then I can just take this out, pop this in the microwave for a few seconds because it doesn't need to be super hot and then just keep it pushing. So these are done y'all. These are done and ready to go. Um, I want to show you guys, I have my salad washed and chopped up in there and I'm going to show y'all how I put this together with the croutons and the dressing. Okay, so here's my to-go lunch. I have the lunch that I showed you guys that I prepped already. So to-go, I have some lettuce here in this bag. And I put my croutons in there as well with a paper towel as well to kind of keep the lettuce together. 
Okay, so this I'll warm up in the microwave for maybe 30 seconds or so. It doesn't have to be piping hot. Um, and then this I will stick inside of here. So what I do is I like to add my dressing and the croutons. And then I like to season with black pepper, some Creole seasoning, and sometimes, let me grab my seasoning out of here. I like to add some Greek seasoning uh to it as well i'll do like seasoning salt and all of that i've been seeing like some salad topper seasoning too that i think i'm gonna try um and go cop some of that you know as much as i eat salad so here's the lid right here you put the lid on there okay and then you just shake it up that's why you don't you really don't want to fill it up too much because it ain't gonna shake right so yeah shake this up Shake, 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 shake your booty. So shake that up real good, real good, real good, real good, y'all. Okay, that's it, you guys. Look at that. You have a nice, delicious, low-calorie lunch that really took no time at all um, to do, and I have enough for the week, okay? So if this helps, if you enjoyed it, um hit those likes hit that subscribe thank you so much for watching it's always appreciated y'all peace out